Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. So, a bit of a different um, video for you today. So, I have been a, a fan of Zoella, I've been watching Zoella for a few years now and every so often she releases a different beauty range and there was so much controversy around last Christmas's range where she released the calendar which was like 50 pounds and the stuff in it you could get from like Poundland for like 10 pounds or something. Um, so I was really excited to see what she was going to release for Christmas this year um, to try and like counteract any negativity that came from last year. Um, she posted something or her team posted something on Zoella Beauty Instagram a few days ago saying that um, there was a new range coming soon and showing us a picture of Cosmos. This is the picture that was posted and it kind of was the first sort of peek at what the new Cosmos range might look like. So I was curious, I googled it and lo and behold I found that Superdrug were selling the whole entire range. And I thought that's weird, like it hasn't been released on Zoella's channels and yeah, like why is Superdrug selling it? So I thought I'll order us something and let's see if it arrives, let's see if it's just a mistake. Um, so I ordered the Cosmos um, fragrance body mist and it arrived. So I feel like this is probably a mistake from Superdrug. They've listed all the products before they were supposed to, before they've been launched and they've also posted it to me. Um, so I thought I would open this with you and to give my first impressions. So the whole range is up on Superdrug. So there is a Big Bang Bath and Body Cracker, Bath Milk Powder, Hand Cream, Lip Balm Duo, Star Bath, Fragrance Mist Collection, Gift Collection, Roller Balls, Solid Bath Oil Melts and Supernova Bathing Collection. Um, so this looks to be a load of things. I assume these are all sort of like Christmas gift type things. I could have ordered everything, but I think that would have come to maybe like a hundred pounds if I got all the different sets and everything to try and get all the products. So I just ordered the spray, which was 12 pounds. So let's spray it and see what it smells like. So this is literally the first time I've sprayed it. Ooh, okay. So it's definitely a bit different. It's quite fresh. It's not particularly sweet, um, like a lot of her other ones have been. What's annoying is it doesn't tell you like the fragrance notes on the package anywhere and it didn't come like in a box or anything. It literally just comes like this. So let me read you what it says on Superdrug that this smells like. So discover a scent that's out of this world featuring crisp, uplifting notes of mint blended with delicious red fruits to create a very special limited edition fragrance. So I can definitely smell the mint. It kind of almost smells like a, kind of like a chewing gum, like minty type fresh smell. It's quite green, it kind of smells like, it smells like you've bought like a mint plant and you're smelling it, it's very, very minty. Um, I can't really smell the red apples that it says are in here. It's like a spearmint. It's not sweet, it's, it's like a spearmint type smell. You know, like a soft mint, spearmint soft mint. Hmm. Not what I expected at all. I associate Zoella's fragrances as quite like girly and sweet and fruity and I guess she has got a bit older and matured and her tastes have probably changed so I guess they're trying to reflect that here. But, hmm, interesting. I don't know how popular this will be because I feel like I don't know if people want to smell like mint or not. I don't, I don't know. Comment below if you love mint and you're excited to try this. Hmm. But basically, I just thought it would be interesting to share this with you. Let me know if you managed to get your hands on it early in the comments below. I will leave the link so you can check it out on the Superdrug website as well. Um, but interesting one. 
£12 for like a minty smelling body mist. I mean, like, is it worth £12? I'm not sure. But having said that, you can go and spend £100 on a perfume and, you know, it might not actually be any better. So I guess as far as fragrances go, it's good value. I'm just not sure about it at all. Very, like, bit left field for Zoella, not what I expected. So thanks so much for watching guys, let me know what you think in the comments below and don't forget to subscribe, I'd love to have you here on my channel. Thanks so much for watching and goodbye!